So you guys probably clicked on this video because you might be an independent filmmaker and you might want to know how to do the teleporting effect for your films, but you don't have any programs at all. All you've got is maybe Windows Movie Maker. You know, that's all, that's all I had. I made a teleporting video a little while back. No! The only, the only programs or anything that I had was just Windows Movie Maker, and so what I got, I got really, really creative, and I think I want to show you guys how I made that video. So, um, here's basically what I did. I, you know, set, set your camera up on your tripod, that's what you're going to want to do. Just set it up and everything, and for every shot, you're going to want to keep it completely still. And, um, later, if you want to, you can add in, uh, fake camera movements, which is what I did. Um, for the for the sequel, but um, so what you're gonna want to do is yeah, set up your tripod like that and everything, and um, just just move around in the frame. You know, have if you got two actors fighting each other or whatever, have one be really still and the other one disappear. But the other one after, after like so like say you want to do a punch and you're going like this, you're punching and then they disappear in the middle of the punch. What you want to do is um, stay still and after they move, come back a couple. Just, just a little bit, a couple inches, and then do it again so you have some give room in there to make sure it looks really realistic. And, um, so what else you're going to want to do is, you're probably wondering how I did the teleporting effect when the camera was moving. Well, um, what we did is, uh, I came up with an idea where I set, because, um, let's see, so this, this axis right here, this joystick controls this way right here, and then this one right here you unscrew and it controls up and down. So what I did was completely tightened the up and down one. Okay, really hard. It can't move up and down at all. Okay, just move it really tight. So it can't move up and down at all. Then what you're going to want to do is um, keep this one loose so you can move it back and forth like this. And what you want to do is um, have your actor here and do a slow pan or, you know, whatever. If you, and if you want to have the, have the frame go instead of side to side, up and down, you're just going to do it opposite. You want this one really tight and this one loose. And so what you're going to do is you're just going to move it really really slowly, smooth, or fast, depending on whatever you want, with your actor there, and then when the camera comes right in the middle of them, you're going to want them to disappear, and so they're going to move or something, and so then what you'll do is go in, um, is right after that, have the exact same thing, shoot it exactly like you just did again, very slow, without the actor there, so what it's going to do is right in between, uh, and then when you go into Movie Maker, in between that clip, so you'll have like the two clips, you'll have the person about to move like this, or whatever, and then you'll um, cut it right, right as they're moving to the clip with no one there. It was the same thing, so it's going to look like one smooth shot. Yeah, that's pretty much all you have, all you have to do. If you have any more questions on, or comments, you want to you ask me anything about how I did my two teleporting videos, leave a comment on this video and I will uh, get back to you on it. So, thanks. So, thanks for watching, guys. That's pretty much it.